Exploring the Departures and When Calls the Heart Season 10 Cast Changes Explained Welcome back to our channel. I know we have got quite dedicated community of When Calls the Heart fans. Today we are delving into some behind the scene drama that exits up some beloved actors from the show. First up we've got Daniel Lissing who portrayed the iconic Monty Jack Thrompton. Now, Daniel bid farewell at the end of season 5, citing personal reasons. In a hurtful Facebook Live, he shared, Circumstances arose for me where I needed to leave when calls the hurt for reasons that are very personal to me. It's touching to see how both Hallmark and his fellow cast members were nothing but supportive during this challenging time. Next on the departure list is Laurie Loughlin who brought the character of Abigail to life. Unlike Daniel, Laurie didn't leave by the choice. The Hallmark Channel had to write her character out after her involvement in the college admission scandal surfaced. In the season 6 premiere, we learned that Abigail had headed back to East to take care of her ailing mother. Now let's talk about Paul Green who starred as Dr. Carson Sifford for 8 seasons, he made his exit in the season 8 finale, heading off for a fellowship in the Baltimore. In a couple of interviews, Paul opened up about his reasons for leaving and hinted at whether he would be open to returning in the future. Eva Bourne, our Clara Santon Flynn, recently spilled the beans on her Instagram about leaving for personal reasons at the end of season 8. And speaking of season 8 departures, Aaron Bucklows, who played Jesse, left the series along with Eva. Their characters, Jesse and Clara, settled just outside of Hope Valley and embarked on a homesteading journey. Now, a burning question in many hearts, is Chris McNally, our Lucas Bochard, leaving when calls the heart? The short answer is no. But hold on, there are hints that McNally might have a reduced role in season 10. In episode 11, Lucas reveals his plan to run for governor after unexpected political twist. This follows a passionate speech in episode 10 about Hope Valley deserving a governor better than the current one. And there you have it, a comprehensive look at the departures in When Calls the Hurt. It's always tough to see beloved characters go, but change is the only constant in life, right? Let me know in the comments what you think about these exits and who you miss the most. So, this much for today guys. Did you enjoy this video? Do let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel because there is so much love in this world. Thanks for watching. We'll see you around.